Got myself another toy here. I believe it's a 1960s. Uh, well, it's a wheel horse. C120. It'll be my uh, tool to do a little bit of everything around here, including a little bit of mowing I got here at the shop. I always kind of had a thing for with for uh, 70s and 80s mowers. So I don't know. We might start a collection here. We'll see. But I'm gonna get this pulled into the paint room and get this thing prepped up for paint here right shortly. That's just going across it lightly with the DA. That's all I'm going to do. Just make sure there's no nib sticking out. And I'm going to do that across most of the flat spots. And around this maybe. Leaf springs a bit, rear axle a bit. Kind of stuff that you see the most.
and then we'll shoot some paint on it. I did shoot clear coat over this. This is just a base coat. Um, I didn't film any of that because of how strenuous it was trying to keep the um, overspray on the down low and yeah, and dealing with moving the camera at the same time, I decided to do the clear coat without filming it, but here it is clear coated. Yeah, that clear coat was a challenge to spray but got it all done went and ate some dinner 
And now we're going to go across to it and see how it looks. Really looks different in the video. It's a bit darker in color in person. In person it's a little darker. But that's it. It's all sprayed. Let's see if it's dry enough. Oh yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this masking tape off yet. Well, I hope you guys liked seeing the paint go on it, finally. Yeah, you can still see the numbers on the frame. Stamps. Really happy with it. I'm a happy customer of my own work. It's not perfect, but quite perfect enough for a daily driver.